Uh, it, well, it's obviously an honor, but it's a huge endorsement for the work that we've done over the last few years. We, we haven't cut any corners. Um, we've tried to build this properly from the ground up, but more importantly, with um, sort of best practices and the standards that people would expect from traditional finance in what is ultimately a new asset class. We're treating it exactly the same, and we're just helping institutions really become familiar with a new asset, make the unfamiliar familiar. Yes, for us, I think over the next few years, we're going to work closely with regulators for more international expansion. I think that's one of the key things for us as we do this, as we, this is why we have a UK license, an Irish license, Abu Dhabi is imminent. Um, so we will work this, we will work through regulation over the next few years because we're in Europe as well. Mika is coming in the next two years and that's really important for us. I think stable coins are a big part of it. They're going to help us with cross-border payments and also with charities. I mean, in the last week, we helped the Make-A-Wish Foundation accept their first ever uh, crypto donation. And we hope to do more of that in the future. Well, being in the Ritz in Paris, I mean, how, how much better does it get? Um, it's fantastic to be here. Um, as we mentioned earlier on, you know, we're in Europe. Europe is leading the way in terms of crypto regulation. Mika regulation will be in within the next 18 months to two years. Um, we're committed to this jurisdiction and uh, it, it's great to see us here in Paris with this regulation coming and, and it helps bring an institutional aspect to this asset class as it grows over the next few years.